today's video, World War II, Britain, 1945, ground tech, and prior will now be facing the monstrous German steel mouse to see how difficult this will be for this nation in this video. Now we had just done USA 1945 ground tech and USSR ground tech and had a lot of subscribers asking for now Britain taking it from the perspective I'm in the tortoise shout out to those that it helped if any of you would like to help with these future challenge vids join the discord as I make the announcements on that and more the merrier now the thing about Britain that makes it a bit more challenging here when they're facing the World War II mouse is unlike USSR that had the real derpy cannons like the KV-2 and America starting to have those higher velocity shells around this time period Britain <laughs> doesn't have either one, which makes it very difficult. They have that standard AP round, and it doesn't have nearly as much penetration or explosive mass as some of these other nations, most likely making this a bit more challenging for them. Going into round one, Mouse turns his turret to start to see the archer trying to zoom across and flank. Mouse lines up a shot, not getting what he needs. Archers moving out, trying to spread ourselves out to get those different positions, get the mouse in a very bad spot. Taking another shot, still missing him. Archer getting a little bit of luck here, however, that 75 millimeter does not have as good of shell velocity. Will this archer be able to make it to the flanking position it needs? Oh, and close. Putting the mouse in a potential bad position here, not wanting to get them along the flanks as those flat sides is gonna be the best chance Bryn is gonna be able to have to penetrate here. Starting to drop Artie, Mouse trying to back himself up to keep that perimeter and that angle from all different sides as much as possible. The Sherman IC getting eyes, rest of the team starting to see the mouse as he starts to get hit by some of that machine gun fire. Sherman IC trying to mark him for the rest of the team and taking shots, but unfortunately gets taken out, not allowing him to engage very closely. <laughs> I don't think he was expecting that that earlier on. It would have to be more barrel shots and track shots from him if the Sherman IC could have done something, but there not was a whole lot he could have done. Still giving Britain the chance to do something with their Centurion Mark I having to get point blank in order to possibly get the chance of a penetration from the mouse side. And the Tortoise, however, being slow is going to make it very difficult. The Centurion Mark I having an insane amount of smoke rounds, trying to blind the mouse, put them in front of him so he can get closer. Mouse starts to see the Dilemar coming up along the side. Trying to dodge it, taking those sharp turns, getting pretty lucky here. That 75 mil, trying to line it up one more time, hitting the tank and knocking out the driver, putting him in a bad spot and finishing him off. Two British tanks down, and me as the tortoise trying to move up, getting eyes on that mouse position. I can start to vaguely see him, but I need to engage and get a lot closer if I'm gonna have a chance of having that penetration I need and hopefully getting a flat enough side is gonna be very, very difficult. Now, <laughs> this mouse player was just getting super annoyed at the Centurion, trying to find him, doing an excellent strategy here, blinding him, as that's gonna be the Centurion Mark One's only chance of really being able to get close here. Matilda Hedgehog starting to launch those high explosive projectiles high up in the air to hopefully land down on top of the mouse which it could potentially be able to do damage, but unfortunately gets absolutely obliterated by Mouse's 128 millimeter shell. Archer and Centurion speaking on Discord, trying to work together to engage and get close. Archer was the one that took the shot earlier, turns around to back up and get a closer shot. Mouse trying to look for that Centurion as he knows he is the greater threat, shooting through the bushes, using that machine gun. Me as the tortoise, finally being able to reach a point where I can shoot the mouse using the machine gun to find him through the smoke, unfortunately not penetrating. Centurion continuing to move up, Mouse taking a shot with that 75 millimeter, not doing anything, trying to back up as fast as he can, taking out a crew member, continuing to shoot him. This is getting intense. 
knocking out this insurance track and leaving the archer to still try and get behind him now still focusing on the centurion firing not doing any damage that time archer turning around taking a shot on the side not penetrating too thick and the centurion gets knocked out archer realizing is in a very bad position here now starts to angle more and killing the archer leaving it to be a one-on-one -on -one versus the tortoise and the mouse. Now this is going to be a very, very tricky battle as the mouse actually has some pretty good penetration against the tortoise. I'm trying to keep myself angled just a little bit as much as I can while still keeping my cannon locked onto that as he starts drawing himself closer and closer to my position trying to back up keep myself angled i take a hit from the mouse luckily not penetrating angling myself is going to be the best bet i have here but at this distance my shell just does not have the penetration it needs trying to aim just right around those side cheeks doing anything i can my tactic here is to hopefully take out the barrel of the mouse Taking out my track, now leaving me unmovable as I try to repair, continuing to try and fire and hit him, doing anything I can. Mouse is not stopping. Hitting me again, almost being done with my track repair. Now that it's done, trying to keep myself as stable and still as possible to see if I can get any shots and hoping to change this battle around. Keeping himself very well angled, he is playing this very, very smart. And his chance of penetrating me becomes much greater as he gets closer. Moving up to take aim once more. Trying to line up to hit my barrel. He knows I'm just about to take a shot. I take the shot, not doing anything to him as I tried hitting his barrel. And he kills me. Leading the mouse to win round one. And in round two, we now introduce the Black Prince. Having a powerful round, but still very difficult to penetrate, and still keeping the Centuron Mark I, as they now rush in, in this episode, to attack the mouse. Now the hard thing about the Black Prince is, <laughs> you still run into the issue of it being super slow. Rest of the team rushing up here, trying to get eyes on where the mouse could be. Now talking all in Discord, doing a little bit more of an unconventional tactic here as trying to all just rush in and see what they can do. Cause mass confusion and utilize their speed and the mouse's slowness as their advantage. Mouse already getting spotted, taking shots from all different sides and sure on Mark 1 already popping that smoke in front of the mouse, blinding him, starting to back up. Mouse trying to get a visual on where these enemies are as just chaotic fire is happening from all around him. Some sure on Mark 1 moving up and trying to get along the side. Mouse getting hit from the right, machine gunning from the left, archers in the distance taking the shots. Centuron still blinding him <laughs> That smoke and zigzagging across, confusing a mouse trying to turn around, does not quite have that mobility. Centuron trying to get along his side, taking a shot, slowing him down, the rest all rushing in, just pounding. And mouse still being very smart and focusing on the Centuron. Black Prince nowhere to be seen, as I'm <laughs> still trying to catch up to the battle. Mouse getting absolutely hammered from memory side. Smaller tanks trying to focus on its barrel, taking it out, leaving the mouse. <laughs> Just this chaotic stake. Britain pulling through and killing the mouse, winning this second round in this excellent comeback. Thank you all for watching. This is the Muffin here. You guys stay cool and keep tanking.